Welcome to Fantastic Vision. Please subscribe us before you watch today's video. On October 15, 2024, the share price of Dutch lithography giant ASML plummeted by 16.26%, hitting the largest single-day drop in 26 years, and the market value evaporated by more than 400 billion yuan. China has turned from the largest buyer to an independent player, and the market of equipment giants in the United States, Japan and Europe is shrinking further. In 2024, China's share of ASML's revenue dropped sharply from 49% to 27%, applied materials sales in China fell by 14 percentage points, and Tokyo Electron's orders to China evaporated by 830 million US dollars. ASML only received 2.63 billion euros in new orders in the third quarter of 2024, a 53% cut from the previous quarter, and only 656 million euros in EUV lithography orders in China. Applied Materials also directly lost 400 million US dollars in annual revenue due to the suspension of equipment maintenance services for Chinese customers. Tokyo Electron's sales of coating and developing equipment in China fell from a peak of 49% to 30%, and the capacity utilization rate of the Malaysian factory fell to 65%. There are three structural variables hidden under the appearance of declining orders. 1. The end of the stockpiling cycle. In 2023, Chinese manufacturers rushed to purchase 374 DUV lithography machines due to concerns about supply interruption, which is equivalent to one-third of the global annual production capacity, resulting in overdrawn demand in 2024. 2. Technology route switching. 80% of the IGBT chips driven by new energy vehicles and power devices required by the photovoltaic industry can be completed in the 28 nanometers process, and the localization rate of field equipment has reached 60%. 3. Concerns about overcapacity. China has built 38 12-inch wafer fabs, accounting for 42% of the world, but the purchase amount of semiconductor equipment in 2024 has dropped by 6%, exposing the real pressure of capacity digestion. This is not a cyclical adjustment, but a subversion of market logic. Analysis pointed out that when China achieves equipment self-sufficiency in mature processes, Every 1% loss of market share by US, Japanese and European manufacturers means that $1.5 billion in orders will evaporate. Shanghai Microelectronics SSA 800 lithography machine will be mass-produced and delivered to SMIC in 2024, with an overlay accuracy of 1.9 nanometers, and a price of only one-third of similar equipment from ASML. SMIC's Primo Twinstar Etcher replaces applied materials equipment in Yangtze Memory's 128-layer NAND production line, with an etching uniformity of 3%. NAURA's NMC6 12-thin film deposition equipment won a 5 billion yuan order from Huahong Semiconductor, and the 14 nanometers FinFET process yield exceeded 92%. Three dimensions. One. Differentiated competition. Avoid the technical blockade of EUV lithography machines, focus on 28 nanometers mature process equipment, and form a moat in tracks such as automotive chips and industrial MCUs. 2. Industrial chain binding. SMIC and Shanghai Microelectronics signed a three-year, $1.5 billion procurement agreement, and the equipment verification cycle was shortened from 18 months to 9 months forming a R&D verification mass production closed loop. 3. Cost advantage fission. Domestic equipment prices are generally 30% to 50% lower than imported ones, driving the cost of chip manufacturing to drop by 12%, which forms a siphon effect in the price-sensitive consumer electronics market. In 2024, China's semiconductor equipment localization rate jumped from 10% to 13.6%, and every 1% increase will replace $420 million of imported equipment. ASML invested 500 million euros to build a lithography machine assembly plant in Vietnam and plans to deliver NXT, 
2000i equipment to India's Tata Electronics in 2025. TSMC Nanjing plant will transfer 28 nanometers production capacity to Malaysia, driving Southeast Asian equipment procurement to grow by 12%. Tokyo Electron raised its revenue target in the Korean market to 35%, trying to compete for Samsung orders with 5 nanometers glue coating equipment. Dual Track System 1. Mature Process Ecosystem China's 28 nanometers and above equipment system has covered key links such as lithography, etching, and deposition, forming a closed loop in the fields of automotive chips and industrial control. 2. High-End Technology Alliance ASML High-NA EUV Lithography Machine Unit price 350 million euros, is monopolized by TSMC and Intel. Only six units will be shipped in 2024, but it contributes 32% of ASML's profits. 3. Battle for the middle ground. In the 14 to 7 nanometers transition process equipment market, the competition between Tokyo Electron and North Huachuang is fierce. The former maintains its advantage by bundling photoresist sales with Shinetsu Chemical, while the latter expands its market share through equipment leasing. Under the cold division of labor pattern, China eats up 70% of the world's demand for mature process equipment, while the profit margins of American, Japanese and European manufacturers in the high-end market have increased to 58%, but they face the risk of shrinking market size. The Ministry of Industry and Information Technology's 2025 plan is clear. The localization rate of 28 nanometers equipment will exceed 50%, and hundreds of billions will be invested to tackle third-generation semiconductor equipment such as silicon carbide epitaxial equipment and gallium nitride etching machines. ASML launched a lithography machine leasing business, with the monthly rent per unit reduced to 1.2 million euros trying to maintain its market presence with a light asset model. Three cores. One, breakthrough in material system. Tokyo Electron's coating equipment advantage is based on the supporting system of Shinetsu Chemicals Photoresist and Dynapon Printing's mask plate, while China still relies on 30% imports in the field of photoresist. Two, service model innovation. Applied Materials launched the Equipment Health Management System, to increase service revenue by 20% through real-time monitoring of component loss, which forms differentiated competition with North Huachuang's whole-line solution. 3. Technical Standard Competition China is formulating the Semiconductor Equipment Interoperability Standard to try to break the private protocol barriers of Tokyo Electron and applied materials. If successful, it will reduce the cost of production line switching by 15%. Analysis and prediction, the global equipment market will form a 37 pattern, from 2025 to 2030, China dominates 70% of the supply of mature process equipment, the United States, Japan and Europe control 90% of the high-end equipment market, and cross-field competition will determine the final voice.